Hey guys, I'm Suze, and today we're gonna learn how to make a teaspoon for your tea set. Why buy a spoon when you can make one? So get started with me on Tinkercad and learn how to make your own spoon. Hi everyone. Today we're gonna be making a spoon in Tinkercad. So the first step is how to create the head of the spoon. To create the head of the spoon, we'll start with a sphere. Squeeze the sphere and resize it to make it about 40 millimeters long and 25 millimeters in diameter. Then import a box. Resize it to make it bigger than the sphere and move it to intersect with the sphere. Then we'll transform the box in whole and we group it with the sphere to cut it in half. Step two, how to make the handle. To make the handle, we start with a box. We'll make it about 10 millimeters by 80 millimeters by two millimeters thick. Then using another box, we make the shape a little bit more interesting and elaborate. We rotate the second box about five degrees and we put it in the top part of the other one. We're going to use the second box as a whole to cut away a slice of the handle and make it thinner in the top part. We create a copy of the second box using the combination Alt and Drag and we mirror it using the mirror tool and apply it on the other side of the handle. We transform then both of these two boxes in whole and group them with the handle. In case you realize that the boxes were not in the correct position, you can easily correct it by ungrouping them and grouping them again after the changes. Now using the arrow keyboard, we'll apply the handle to the head of the spoon. Check the position from different points of view to make sure everything's okay. And once you're satisfied, group all of the elements together. Step three, how to create the inner part of the head. To create the concavity of the spoon, we create a copy of it using the combination Alt and Drag. We ungroup the elements and we delete the handle. Now we only need the head of the second spoon. We resize it by making it a little bit smaller and then transform it into a hole. We align it with the head of the spoon and once we're satisfied with the position, we group it with the rest of the body. And now we have our spoon. Thanks guys, I can't wait to see the spin that you put on your own spoon. Definitely upload your own designs to your profile on Kira Kira. Awesome job guys, now you have your teaspoon. So continue taking all of the classes and upload your own unique designs to kirakira.com. Thanks, bye.